Center had that magical playoff run a year ago. Tigers look primed to make another deep playoff run this year. Liberty Center off to a 3-0 start. They've only allowed 21 total points so far tonight, making that trip. Over to take on Wasi on start second half. Quarterback Elijah McLeod rolling out to his right. Looking for a receiver, throws over the middle. It's tipped by a Tiger, falls into the hands of another. Landon Cruz would take off, but he tripped up in Wasi on territory. That would lead to Liberty Center in the red zone. They hand it off to Colton Cruz. He finds the end zone. It's 32-6 Liberty Center, but they're not done yet. Finally, quarterback Zane Zider going to air it out to Landon Cruz. Comes down with a touchdown grab here. The Cruz kids all over the field tonight. That would extend the Tiger lead to more than 30 and start the running clock. They get the win 40-6, to six, and Chase Bachman has more from Wasia. Tonight, two of the best teams in the NWOAL faced off, but in the end, Liberty Center's offense was just too much for Wasia on. Well, I think emotionally it's it's a huge confidence boost for our guys because we know how talented they are and how well coached they are. And I thought we came out here and played extremely well. Our front three did a great job of getting enough pressure to make them uncomfortable and then on the back end we made some plays when the ball was in the air uh, and, and that's you know that's off the guys back there for us because that's a great team with a lot of very good athletes. I thought our guys stepped up and played well on defense. Um, you know our coaches really stressed that like I said before they had all the all the talent to come back whenever they wanted so it was it was a focus thing um, just focus every play doing our job because if we let that if we let them back in the game it could be scary. Washington had a lot of playmakers um, Everybody makes plays, but it was it was our goal, you know, coming in. Got to get on top of them early, or else they're gonna stick around. And I mean, they they're dangerous. Well, Zane did a great job. I mean, the line blocked great, so good throw by Zane. Yeah, we're definitely looking forward to it. After next year, we got kind of embarrassed, so we're looking to get them back. Liberty Center wants to stay unbeaten, but they will have a huge test next week when they host Archbold. Reporting in Wauseon, Chase Bachman, WTOL 11.